Wouldn't it be great to teach a robot a new task that it knows nothing about in advance, from just a single demo and no further data collection? And to be able to deploy this task immediately after, in a different environment, with distractors, in novel object configurations, and with changes in lightning conditions. In this work, we show that this is possible by modeling imitation learning as a trajectory transfer problem. Assuming only a single demonstration, trajectory transfer maps the demonstrated trajectory to a novel scene, allowing for a successful task completion. In practice, this can be achieved by estimating the relative pose of the target object between the demonstration and the deployment scene. And when no prior object knowledge is available, this can be done through unseen object pose estimation. To explore the utility of unseen object pose estimation for imitation learning, we provide an in-depth study of how state-of-the-art estimators perform for one-shot imitation learning on 10 real-world tasks. We then take a deep dive into the effects of camera calibration and pose estimation errors on task success rates. We also investigate the spatial generalization capabilities of trajectory transfer and its robustness to changes in lightning conditions. We base our study on the following 10 real-world tasks that span a broad range of complexities. We begin our investigation by measuring the sensitivity of task success rates to errors in starting and effective positions prior to replaying demonstrations. To achieve this, we start by recording an initial object pose that enables us to manually reset the task. We then provide a last stage demonstration. and then repeatedly reset the environment, move the end effector to a noisy starting position, replay the demonstration, and note if the task execution was successful. We do this 10 times for increasing position noise magnitudes. Finally, we map these starting and effector position errors to either calibration or pose estimation errors using an empirical mapping. The results for this experiment are shown in this graph. These results show that the task success rate for all considered tasks is more sensitive to pose estimation errors than to camera calibration errors. We now investigate if the trajectory transfer formulation of one-shot imitation learning can learn real-world tasks. We benchmark eight pose estimators, including iterative closest point, correspondence estimation-based methods, and direct estimation approaches evaluating them for trajectory transfer. We additionally benchmark them against DOME, a state-of-the-art one-shot imitation learning method. Here we can see example rollouts for each of the considered methods on the T-task. Here we also show example rollouts for all the base stands for the plug task. Our results show that the unseen object pose estimation formulation of one-shot imitation learning is capable of outperforming DOME by 22% on average. We additionally investigate the robustness of the best performing method to changes in lightning conditions. Our results indicate that trajectory transfer using regression displays a strong performance even when the lightning conditions are randomized between the demonstration and the testing with an average decrease in performance of only 8%. If you want to take a deep dive into our pose estimation perspective of one-shot imitation learning, we invite you to read our paper and visit our website. Thank you.